Welcome back to the Spirited Shop. I am the Spirited Maker and today we're going to do a test. A test of masking tapes. I have here the Scotch Blue Tape and the Scotch Normal Masking Tape. I put a strip of the blue and a strip of the normal masking tape on this piece of plywood and I am going to laser etch the same design in both and then we're going to take the design out and paint it and see which one works better and if this one works as well as this because this is twice as expensive then we're going to go with regular masking tape from now on but if this is markedly better we'll stick with the the blue painter tape so so i'm gonna get this set up on the uh cnc and we'll laser etch it out and we'll give it a painting and see which one comes out on top i'm hoping the cheaper one does but that probably isn't how it's going to go so Give me a minute to set it up. All right, some quick observations. The bigger sections on the blue painter tape is a whole lot easier to get off than on the regular masking, but the regular masking holds up better together when you're doing the finer detail stuff. So when I'm pulling the finer detail off, these come off, breaks apart more easily, whereas the regular masking tape stays together so now we're just going to do the paint part because that's really what this is about. I'm going to paint over them and then let them dry and then we'll come back and we'll peel them off and see which one stops bleed, which one works the best. So give me a minute to paint them, we'll let them dry and then we'll see which one came out on top. All right, I've painted them, it's dried. I am going to remove the masking tape and the blue painter's tape and we'll see which one looks better. I'm not going to record it because it's tedious getting all the little things out, but I'll come, we'll come back in a minute and see which one did better. So remember, blue is on top, masking tape on bottom. All right, it's time for conclusions. The top was the blue painter's tape, the bottom was regular masking tape. You can definitely see that specifically in areas like around the bottom of the star versus this one you see a lot a little bit more bleeding um, but it's really not that big a difference I think part of the issue is this is very thin wood and the acrylic just wicks in so maybe if I have a better paint or coating substance and that may be something I do spray a, a protective coat a clear coat first put the tape on etch it then paint it then another clear coat so I may do some experiments like that but one of the observations I do have when getting large areas off the blue painters tape is easier but getting the fine detail areas off Regular masking tape is easier. But that's the result. Same process. Only difference is tape. So 
I'm not sure yet. I'm going to try again with, like I said, maybe doing a clear coat and then masking it. So maybe that clear coat will stop some of that wicking away. And if that's the case, then maybe matte regular masking tape will work just as well. So I'm going to try that in a different, maybe different video or something. Maybe, maybe not. We'll see. Anyway, that's the results. So thank you for watching this video. Thank you for your time today. Please like, share, and subscribe. And as always, friends, God bless. And until next time, I'll see you.